Hi, and welcome back to EPG. I am your host, Greg. Today, we're going to talk about the semi-official, semi-unofficial national drink of the beautiful country of Latvia. And if you've spent any time up there in the Baltics, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. And of course, for those that know, that drink is black balsam. Black balsam is everywhere. Everywhere you go in Riga, you can get black balsam. Now, black balsam has a history, like a lot of things that came to Europe from China. And over in China, they were very big on using natural herbal remedies uh, for health things, um, illnesses. And Marco Polo brought this back to Europe in the 13th century. And those ideas kind of spread like wildfire. And one of the places where that really took hold was the very large trade city of Riga. So there was a pharmacist there, like pharmacists all over the world, uh, especially in New Orleans, uh, who took some of these ideas of black balsam, uh, herbal liqueurs, herbal remedies, put them together with a little bit of liquor, and then started selling them. And this began in 1752 uh, by a gentleman named Kunze. He made it into a company, Black Balsam, Riga Black Balsam, and he started selling it everywhere. And when I say you can get it anywhere, you can get it anywhere. Even if stores don't sell black balsam, if you're nice to somebody, they always have some in the back that they can sell you. That's how prevalent it is. And it's also really good. Now, my friend back from Lithuania, Dean, said that since I was going to Riga, I would need to go to this one place called Folk Club Ala, which was a basement club um, in Riga, which has a lot of uh, shows and they had a stage and it's a restaurant and bar. So I went to Folk Club Ala. Again, I'll give you the address and GPS coordinates, as usual. Um, and I had a flight of black balsam. Now I had the regular flavor, which was very good. I had the black currant, or currant, or however you pronounce it, um, flavor. And I also had the cherry. Now cherry was my personal favorite, but all of them were super good, super tasty, a little sweet. Um, Maybe kind of like an amaretto, except, you know, heavier. But I could tell that if, you know, maybe people weren't feeling that well, if they were sick, especially given the colder climate of Lafayette, uh, they would sip this and they would feel better. They would put it in a hot toddy, as, you know, I would like to have done. Um, but yeah, no, definitely black balsam is the, one of the hallmarks of Latvia and it's a great country filled with lots of uh, interesting people and interesting pastimes which I'll get to in a you know future video but if you want to get a little taste of Riga have some black balsam and while you're at it have some for me so this has been Eat Pray Greg thank you very much for your time and uh, yeah get out there